Good morning, you guys. So right now it is currently 3 a.m. We're just kind of getting out everything ready and everything packed into the car and we're gonna shoot out for Arizona here in a little bit. And we're off. We just dropped the dogs off at my dad's and now we're going back through Boise. I fell asleep as soon as we left Boise and so I just woke up a little bit ago and now everything's all light out. Our favorite stop, we're in Nevada now. Alamo. So we left at 3 a.m. and right now it is 8 a.m. We left the greenness and now we're getting back into the desert land. Yeah. I just woke up from another nap, but there's cactus everywhere. So cute. You know we had to stop when we hit Vegas. It's scary now. <laughs> I didn't know it was looking at me. So we just made it. Let's see. It's so cute. Oh, it's so cute. I'm gonna go in the tent. Do you wanna come with me? And make the first uh discovery. Yeah. Oh, there's a little cactus on the ground. It's so hard. Uh -huh. okay. So freaking cute. Oh my goodness. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but like the lukewarm. What do you think about it? <laughs> I'm camera shy. <laughs> it's beautiful. I think my baby for everything. Yeah. Vlog boyfriend, you know. Oh, there's cows. They're stampeding, Lucas. <laughs> so this is the place that we're at right now. You can check them out on Instagram, I think. Oh, that's a shower curtain, I think, to put up. That's so cute. There's a little plant in there. Okay. It's one of the tents. Oh, there's the cows again. We're trying to start a fire, but... I don't really know how to. Thank you. Yeah, my fingers are long.
Good morning. Just survived our first night. We had a little fire. We tried to stargaze, but it was really hard to to try and actually find the stars. But 7 a.m. we're gonna go check out the Grand Canyon. It's only open from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m. So it's the first thing on our to-do list. Here's breakfast for today. Lucas looks like he has Takis and chips. We went in early last night because I got freaked out that there'd be aliens. But right now we're gonna look for little alien footprints to make sure. But tonight's safe. Walk into the bathroom, but I don't know if somebody lives there. That one has a hammock. We didn't get a hammock. It's freaking cute. I think we saw lights from there last night, but nobody was there. And then... They... Getting loud. We heard them all night. And there's our tent. showers in the bathroom. We made it to the Grand Canyon. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. There's just too many bug June bugs. <laughs> so many little sticks. Look at it just split right there. Wow. Yeah, people go way out there. It's so pretty. There's no one over here. I know he is. Oh gosh. You let me get pretty close. <laughs> so pretty out here. No, you're gonna ruin it. <laughs> Some of these rocks sound hollow when I step on them. They're like horses. Beautiful. Go next to it. Mm -hmm. Go next to it. He's 
Like, who are you? Oh my god. He's not interested. <laughs> He's the littlest bit. Look at his little neck beard. It's so cute. He's so fluffy. He's just like a little asshole. Stinky. Just finished our... You wanna go to that restaurant after? Yeah! Cross. Stop. Cross. Stop. Cross. Stop. Yeah. Thrift for goodness Oh, it's called sake. Altitude Spar and Grill. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. This place is so cute. I love it. Look at that. Zany. Um, gift cards and jewelry. Yeah. Maybe because Route 66. Definitely. But. Absolutely. Oh, I'm starving. That's the pizza place we're gonna go to. It's so pretty here. It's so warm too. Oh, I love Arizona. Hey. Mm. Arizona has Dutch Bros. You, you. <laughs> We didn't even think it was out here. We're on our way to the trailhead. So we're gonna go hike up. Harrison. Harrison with the P. I saw Harrison. <laughs> That's a Harrison trail. <laughs> <laughs> you can't you wanna rob me, but I got too much. <laughs> you can be dead, period. Keep going. I'm on your porch with a gun in your son, sitting in yeah. the 40s. So I can hold me, I guess it all by my nose. Other than that, the shit, you can read it and read. I know. I don't think it'd be that close to the road. I can feel that. I know. Ninety-six. Oh, on the way to our hiking spot. I think it's just gonna be beautiful. <laughs> Everyone has buggies and canoes. And uh, dirt road, oh my gosh. Half these roads we go on are dirt roads. Bring your trucks. <laughs> this car is not made for this. We only got five miles. Not 100%. Uh, so bumpy. You're going to make it slide off. You cannot find the trail, so Lucas is going to go and ask. Where to go? Oh my goodness. All right, we're on the hike down. It's so pretty over here. Oh my gosh, it's so red. This is a hike to get here. Water's back there, but the guy told us if we keep going for about how long? A couple miles. A couple miles? But he said that that was a mile or two miles, and that was like five minutes. Oh. Well, if we keep going for a little bit longer, there's no, a pool area with a waterfall. Made it to the first stream. First stream. Can't lose our spot in the in the hike race. But the guy said that after the first stream, you keep going. There's oh geez, tall grass. Oh my goodness! Keep it moving. Those look like strawberries. I don't think they are. These are here. Oh, yeah. oh gee. How long have we been hiking for? Like 10 minutes? No way. Long I don't know. 10 minutes is a long time. Half an hour. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Wow, look at that. It's like... That's like where a witch's home would be. 
Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. Oh. That's a different character. Well, oh. okay. Holy cow. I think that's supposed to be flooded. I think we're getting close. I wonder if he can jump off. Yeah, he said something about cliff jumping. Really? What? Baby lizard. We made it. I know. That's crazy though. I wonder how like if this is just like the spot. I wonder if you can jump off all the way up there. <laughs> Dude, that's crazy though. Oh, like no bring our jumping. bathing suits. Yeah, they probably just like hand up high. No bathing suits. Should we go in? I wonder if it's cold. Right over there by the dog. Oh. He's gonna jump. So I can go in like a needle and I won't touch the bottom? Ow. Huh? I could probably go in like a needle. I don't know, dude. That's pretty far. I like slap the ground so hard. Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's time to head back. our tent um my car is driving on a donut right now so we have to stay an extra day to go to the the tire place to get a new tire but we made it back safe i'm sorry for popping the tire okay so it looks like this is supposed to be our final day here and we we're supposed to just leave but because we popped our tire we have to stay until monday so that we can get our tire fixed somewhere in one of the nearby towns. So, someone already rented the tent after us, so we're gonna be moving tents, so we had to pack up everything. Yeah, we're gonna go check out the shower. Okay, we just got back to Flagstaff. We're gonna get lunch first and see if Walmart will be able to change the tire. We got here kind of early, it's 10.45, and lunch doesn't start until 11, so we're just gonna walk around and see if we can wait till lunch to get some sandwiches. Okay, so change of plan. No tire centers are open, so we got some goo and some rubber cement, and we're gonna try and fix the tire, kind of like a bike tire, and fill it up. With slime. With slime, <laughs> and see if it works. It's like 70 degrees out, but we found an air pump by Chevron. Oh, that's so dusty. This water I got. Ah, oh, I thought that leaf was a bug. <laughs> I 
think we did it! We gooped up our tire and now we're ready to roll. I don't think it's going nowhere. After about 40 minutes of driving, the tire pressure went back down to like 15. So we're here at another Chevron, another air place, trying to reseal it a little bit better. At least it's nice out. <laughs> so we had to move tents because we had to stay a little bit. Um, and someone else already had our like yurt tent reserved. So we just moved to the furthest one. It's pretty nice. It's way more isolated than any of the others. And oh my goodness, it's so cute. We actually got towels this time. She didn't give us towels in the last one. And we have a cute little hammock. Not so bad. We're gonna try and get up early in the morning and get our tire checked out or fixed or something. If Lucas can't fix it. Steady leaking, it's so windy, oh my god. Dude, that's about, uh... Yeah, trying to gather sticks for our fire. Oh my god, this is awful. Ugh. I wonder where the cows went. Shit day. There's the Owen shower. What a <laughs> Oh, it's so pretty here. Oh my god, it's so beautiful here. This is a shower. It's cute. <laughs> We're on our way home. More cows by the road. Cat <laughs> <laughs> discount oh, tire. We kind of like sealed it. It's oh, okay. just losing air constantly. We'll see how long this takes and how much it costs. We're gonna get some teriyaki bowls before we hit the road. They add avocado to bomb. Okay, it's on the chicken. Is it hot or no? I don't think I got enough. Yep. That was that was a lot. Right on my tongue. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. We got our tires fixed. Two new tires. Ready to go back home. Let's see if this is it. There it is. No, it's 422. We missed it. Utah. 
but just barely in Utah and Kanab. So I have 650 more miles. We made a pit stop to check out some pink sand dunes or some coral pink sand dunes. It looks orange. Ah. Holy cow. There's just like this field of grass. Or not grass, they're just little plants. It's crazy. So cool, it reminds me of the Bruno sand dunes. Okay, here we get back on the road. That was one of the best trips ever oh my gosh you have to go and check out those tents at that place you're in the middle of the arizona desert just another trip for the log